Hey guys, I know that I said that there was gonna be a part two to my 2020 year end recap, yet here we are, three months, no, four months into 2021, and still nothing yet. Maybe promises are meant to be broken. When we were younger, my mom always filmed us growing up, and my main motivation in making these vlogs is that I want to have a remembrance of my life in my 20s. During a pandemic, what I did, and I want to look back and remember these times. Like this, I have a fringe in 2021. Is that you, Grade 2 Gaia? So yeah, I just want to have a time capsule of everything that's been going on this year and the next year. And hopefully this isn't going to be my last vlog for this year. Wish me luck! <laughs> These were the things that we bought yesterday and Kuyo is gonna assemble them to make outdoor lights for the farm. What are you doing? Olivia! Okay, plug it in and then we'll see if it works. Wow! And Kuyo is fixing this place up. He's gonna open up a cafe slash restaurant over here. Indai! Eating! He's so old! We're on our way to the farm. This is what it looks like. Okay, so this is our container van house. It's not yet finished. See, the steps are not yet finished, but since we stay here most days, we have to sleep somewhere. So it's like a storage room slash sleeping area. That's where my parents sleep, and I just brought. So this is my side of the room. And I'm gonna try and make it livable. I have my single mattress. chair is very comfy. I just bought it for a thousand pesos. But I still, I'm so happy. And my bed. I'm still deciding if I want the couch here or here. So that this serves like the table. Part of the room. 
I love the farm because everything is just so simple. You have to eat, sleep, take a bath. I'm very contented with this simple kind of life. I get to watch the sunset every day and wake up, have coffee, and it's very cold here at night. I get to be with my parents and spend time with them and meet new people through Picnic Davao, accommodate them. It's very nice. It's not what I planned when I was graduating, but still I'm very grateful. And I can say that we're very blessed to have this farm very close to the city. This place is just like 30 minutes from the city. Yeah, look at our view from the room. Wake up and have this view every day. My parents and I are working on this project since our comfort room right now is very small. Look, so this is the comfort room. It's very small. We have a simple toilet and a shower. So with the money that I got from hosting picnics here at the farm, we're able to make a new comfort room. So let's check the progress out. That's the bonfire area and this is the comfort room. So what's the plan? Entrance, no? Oh. Regular and size. Oh. Regular and size. Regular and size, guys. Shower. Parang yung may ganun lang. Mm. Ang wall nito, hindi direction ganun. So, may portion na ganun. Pababa dyan, ito sarado. Mm. The whole thing. Para ang view mo, ito, wala itong roof. Yan ang view. Okay, Liv, let's show them around. Ouch! So these are our dragon fruits. We haven't figured them out. They haven't been producing fruits yet. My plant died. We have three hammocks and one hammock in the middle. It's triangle. You wanna go up here? Liv? A crying baby. Okay, okay. Why? Why? Why crying well, baby? Um, she wants to wear the boots. Okay, wear the boots. Okay. So this farm has been around since 1997. My dad planted all these mango trees. And now Olivia gets to enjoy it. Diba, Liv? Saan kayo galing? <laughs> they got this toy! Okay, okay, get now, Olivia. I don't go for lunch. I just woke up from my nap. So now I'm gonna get ready and do a shoot for this brand that I love. I got this top from Are Mare. You can check them out on Instagram. I think it's called the Big Top. And I'm gonna pair it with this linen skirt that I thrifted. So it opens up like this. Charge me, please. I don't really use makeup brushes, I just use my fingers. <laughs> so I have this peachy and natural thing going on with my glitter eyes. I like to keep it natural, so it's just very subtle. Time if I'm doing my light makeup, I actually don't know what I'm doing. Then 
things I learned from my friends or from watching some videos, but I'm not an actual expert on makeup. Oops! As you can see, I have pimples because of my masks. They have masked me, but um, I'm not gonna cover them up anymore because it might irritate them further. So this is who I am. <laughs> oh yeah, they're gonna be there when I take photos. And it's okay, because we're all imperfect, but we're still beautiful just the way we are. My Lola bought me this curling iron for my birthday. I think it was 2019. I don't know what's it called, but it's cheaper in shop. And it's very easy to use. I just like that. <laughs> okay, it's not hot enough. So I'm done getting ready, and this is the top. Pare mare top. My theme for this photo shoot is, of course, picnics. <laughs> nice setup. In the middle of my shoot, the guest asked me if they could take a photo. So I'm gonna go and take a photo of them. There are a lot of things I can use as props. Uh, maybe this basket is cute. And this fan. And I'm not getting paid to do these photo shoots, but it keeps my creative juices flowing and it's very fun for me, so I do it. <laughs> taking photos and I don't think any of those turned out good <laughs> but I drank wine our other guests are here and they're doing a prenuptial photo shoot These are our other clients. They're having a prenuptial shoot. Now they're installing the outdoor lights that Kuya Ile assembled. They're fixing the steps. And there's the moon. 